WBUA 23's Jabari Pruitt joins us live in the studio with more. Jabari. Well, Tamika, I sat down with Mayor Walt Maddox to see how he felt about the upcoming budget. And he says the budget is complex, but he feels good about it. Tuesday, Tuscaloosa Mayor Walt Maddox will present his $200 million budget to the council. It's probably one of the most difficult but exciting budgets that I've been working on for the past 10 years. Mayor Maddox says the city is still overcoming the challenges of the recession in April 27, 2011. But he says in his budget, he wants to elevate the city over the next decade. I think what we're presenting to the city council is a mixture of a very conservative fiscal policy while simultaneously expanding beyond with some pretty bold initiatives in certain areas. I asked the mayor how state cuts will impact Tuscaloosa's agencies. Well, I do think that what's happening in Montgomery does have an impact here in Tuscaloosa. I mean, if the state uh, reduces its, uh, for example, if it reduces corrections or reduces funding to mental health, uh, we will see that directly reflect our jail budgets and our law enforcement budgets because we will be picking up those issues and that'll be something to watch out for. Issues such as the stock market. Monday it closed sharply lower with the Dow Jones down more than 588 points. It certainly uh, could have an influence on revenue collections in the next year. So we're going to keep an eye on all of that. But the mayor says he's hopeful the council will embrace, debate, and ultimately pass his budget. But we feel very strong about Tuscaloosa's economy. Uh, we see a lot of growth, um, and we believe that growth will eventually result into more tax generation. Now, the mayor says he foresees no job cuts for the city. And again, he will present that budget to the council tomorrow night at 6 o'clock. But for now, reporting live from the studio, Jabari Pruitt, WVUA 23 News.